music which is news to news which is music in farmers' ears. News of a chemical that puts out oil or petrol fires quicker than anything ever tried before. Called chlorobromomethane and being demonstrated here at Feltham, it is hoped to make a big oil-based disaster as things of the past. First, a demonstration of the portable extinguisher. The blaze was going well, but it is extinguished in less than five seconds. In only one second more, a fire three times the size is dealt with just as effectively. And there are 180 gallons of burning oil and petrol in this test. Machinery and fabric are not damaged by the new chemical, so automatic extinguishers can be safely installed indoors, designed to start themselves when fire breaks out. Electrical transformers with oil cooling systems are typical examples, and in this test the transformer contains 40 gallons of boiling oil. But this is what happens when fire breaks out. Speed in dealing with oil fires is all important, since immense heat is generated, so automatic extinguishers have to start at the very outset of the fire. But for the test, the fire is purposely allowed to get a good hold before the extinguisher is set into action. The highlight of the demonstrations is a revolutionary self-contained extinguisher which floats at the surface of an oil tank. One or more of these, according to the size of the tank, will go into action on the first sign of heat, and the resolving nozzle sprays a chlorobromomethane over the entire surface. This huge tank is the same size as the one which caught fire and started Britain's biggest post-war blaze in 1951. In that disaster at Avonmouth, Bristol, the fire could never have spread to other tanks if the floating extinguisher had been used. Instead, like these, the fire would have been put out in six and a half seconds. No wonder farmers say, this news is music in our ears. <laughs> <laughs>